your latest news update from Western Mass News. Good Friday afternoon. I'm Chris Pisano with a look at your headlines. The attorney for Chicopee School Superintendent Lynn Clark addressed the media today, two days after she was arrested for lying to the FBI. Attorney Jared Olinoff says a lot of parts of the court paperwork filed by the prosecutors is not accurate. He says Clark met with the FBI three different times without consulting a lawyer, and none of the three meetings were recorded. More pictures from inside the Roderick Island Courthouse in Springfield. These photos were shared with Western Mass News, showing ceiling tiles down on the floor inside the building. Attorney Jeffrey Morneau, who is representing courthouse employees in a lawsuit to try and shut down the courthouse, believes this was a result of the heavy rain we experienced last night. Last month, an independent study revealed toxic cancer-causing mold inside the building. As the number of high-ranking Washington officials tested positive for COVID-19 cases increases, people in President Biden's inner circle are preparing in case the commander-in-chief contracts the virus. On Friday, his deputy communications director said it's possible the president could get COVID, but she says he's vaccinated and boosted. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi tested positive Thursday. She was in close contact with the president just the day before. Well, overall, a decent afternoon of weather after a rocky start last night with rain, thunder, and wind. Today, much different, but for tomorrow, 40s and 50s. And look at that. More rain comes in after midnight tonight, so some showery periods likely throughout the overnight into tomorrow as well. It doesn't look like a washout, but look at that. 1, 2 o'clock could be a downpour, so not the best of days. Cooler through the weekend, but then look at this. By early next week to midweek, we have a big warm-up coming. Temperatures could approach or exceed the 70 degree mark. So the extended forecast, we're going to focus on right now. Again, Saturday's 58, a shower two in the morning, maybe one in the afternoon. Sunday, mostly dry, could be a shower in the afternoon. 60 and sunny on uh, Monday, a great way to start off uh, spring break for many of you folks that go to school, at least elementary school and high school. Tuesday could be a shower, but look at this, 70-ish possible midweek. Could be another shower chance Thursday into Friday, but overall, above average temperature theme as we head into mid to late week next week. I don't think there'll be any complaints in that department at all. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.